conduction deafness develops in disorder of heart and of heart. Disorder in the conducting zone. Lesion in the auditory nerve. Lesion in what is called a superior olivet. But normally in the conducting zone, if there is any defect in either eardrum, the auditory ossicles, these are all the conducting elements to the what is called the round window or the sorry the oval window. So when these conducting elements what called actually there is conducting zone when they are being disturbed then we have what is called the conduction deafness occurs. So one of the common causes of conductive hearing loss is blockade of the external auditory meters with the wax. Another cause of conductive hearing loss is perforated eardrum. These are all the conducting zones. Injury to the head can also cause the ossicles of the middle to become disconnected from one another, thus breaking the conducting pathway to cochlea. So, the conducting zone is affected in the case of conduction deafness. Disorder of the conducting zone, nothing but the various areas like eardrum, that is, a, that is what we call the tympanum, the ear ossicles, the whole window, etc. 